John? Yes, sir. You ready to get it? Hey, be. come on. You got to do the boat ramp dance. Get it. Come on. What's up, knuckleheads? Welcome back. Sorry I ain't had a video in a while, but the past couple weeks have been kind of crazy for me. Work's been good, which is a, a bonus and a positive, but I blew the motor in my truck, so now I'm in the market for a truck. I haven't really had a chance to do a whole lot, you know, with my truck being down and, and work being as busy as it is. So this is my first time out in 2021. It's our first tournament of the year. It's a joint tournament between Queen City and Altitude. And I finally get up and get to go fishing a little bit because I have not fished all year. In fact, I haven't been, I haven't even had my boat out of the warehouse since the championship on Sharon Harris. That's how long it's been since I've got to go fishing. So I'm Jones a little bit. I'm ready to get out there and get after it. So we'll see how it goes today. Check it around. So we got to our first, first boat ramp. And I think everybody that's fishing the tournament decided to come to this little bitty boat ramp. The last time I was at this ramp, last year there was only two people here, but there, the other boat ramp is closed for construction. So I think everybody came here. So we're going, me and Jonathan behind me, we're going to go with plan B and go to this other big public boat ramp. It's a bigger ramp, so if it's crowded, it won't be as bad, but this ramp right here that we wanted to fish out of it, it's a it's a tiny boat ramp and it is packed i mean there there's a lot of people there it looked like a bowl of kayak fruity pebbles out there in that cove waiting to launch so you gotta be patient grasshopper so we here we are back on the water tournament one lake james we, uh, I'm gonna see what we can get into. I'm gonna ride around and grab a little bit and see what I can find. I'm gonna commit to the, uh, underspin and the infamous A-Rig today. I don't, uh, I don't use that A-Rig a whole lot, so we'll see how it goes. Yeah, right here it drops off right here. It's about 30 feet, yeah. and they're stacked up right there. But I can't get them to hit nothing. <laughs> so I figured I'd cruise this A rig over through it a couple times. Well, for the life of me, I can't figure out what I'm doing wrong. I have resorted. To trolling a crankbait because it's two o'clock and I've missed one fish that's the only action I've had all day I don't know I don't know I'm just gonna troll around with this crankbait if that don't work I'm gonna load it up and go to the house I don't know sorry guys it ain't been an action-packed day I guess you have those though well, it's the morning after a very disappointing tournament. I, I'm finally over my tournament headache and the great big old skunk I put on the board. But come to find out, a lot of people struggled because I got on Tourney X this morning and looked at the standings and I have 110 people only six limits were submitted. And I think only 43 people caught at least one fish. So, <clears throat> it seems like it's a pretty tough day for everybody. So, I'm not super disappointed in myself. You know, it it is what it is. Things happen. Got to move on to the next one. Uh, 
I guess I'll just take this one as a drop for for the for the year. I don't know. It was just a it was a rough day. I mean, the weather wasn't terrible. It was cold starting out and windy. But the, terrible, the weather wasn't terrible. So, you know, I can't I can't really blame weather on anything. I I committed to the A rig, which is something I don't fish with a lot. And I think that that might have had something to do with it because I really, I grinded out with that thing a lot. And I really only threw four baits yesterday. I threw the A rig a lot, an underspin. I trolled a crankbait a little bit. And then, you know, I, I beat up some structure and docks with a shaky head. And I just, I just didn't, I didn't come up with nothing. I missed one fish. I, I did set the hook on one. And it was one of those situations where, I wasn't paying attention. I mean, I wasn't catching fish, and I really wasn't expecting the bite, to be honest with you. And I noticed that he picked it up, <clears throat> and my line started moving, and by the time I set the hook, he'd already spit it. So, you know, it, it is what it is. You know, like I said, we'll move on to the next one, and we'll see how the next one goes. Appreciate everybody. Like, share, and subscribe.